Today in this brand new edition of holography and 3D, last, uh, last time I made a little uh, pyramid and it got me so inspired and I found out that holography can also be like mono, you know, to, to, to make a perfect holographic video to be used with the pyramid thing then you should have four cams one in front of you one at the right side at the back and at the left to get that 3d effect so you can walk around it and inspect it and see what a guan but let's say if you don't really care too much about walking around but you still want to see that the front is what you see like when you look at the front of a, you know a real uh, holographic screen then this is the answer and you know what anyone can create it from stuff that is being thrown away that you can get as garbage maybe your neighbor still has an old monitor for you only thing you need of course is a screen for the projection some tape <laughs> and a piece of glass nice shiny glass but I think uh, plastic will also work you know uh, but it must be nice and shiny and clean you know no scratches on it it must look good but you must be able to look through it it must be glass so you know you see my hand here it's behind the glass you don't even see the glass the glass is standing here this is my glass screen that I added to this laptop and what happens if I turn it on you already see something there and I don't know if you can see it I will uh, yeah it's very light here in the house so let me turn on some lights here I think you can already see it a little bit better it don't have to be uh, completely dark but you need some darkness and here it is um, today I'm demonstrating my glass display and uh, what it is it gives a holographic 3d effect I must put it a little bit higher for you. Right I can see that you don't see the head. The holographic environment. If you also have this glass, as you can see, it's not very uh, professional yet. Here you can see the cable, and uh, it's just a cable to hold the glass for now. I think you see the head now, eh? Let's walk around it. Just imagine that you're Skyping with someone like this. Let me, uh, this video was specially created today for this purpose. And you can see it even better. And uh, it looks, it looks really good. You can look straight through the glass at the back. 
You see, my hand is at the back. Now we have the 3D uh, uh, techniques with glasses and with. Uh, you see, and the picture is not here. The picture is, in fact, here. And that also gives a 3D, a 3D um, experience. I watched videos yesterday with it, Bonanza, and especially in the dark, uh, in the dark scenes of the video when the people are inside in the house, then you really see the 3D effect. You know, it's it's really um, nice to watch videos because also your eyes don't hurt from the LCD screen. So, you know, if you're also getting headaches of uh, looking at the screen, I think this is, uh, yeah, a way better way to watch videos. So this is my holographic uh, projector, CQ screen. I find it looking really good. This is still in beta. Soon I'm going to do a Skype session with a lady or maybe a friend or my family and then we will see how it looks. But if I look at it, I really see the 3D thing that I was seeing in uh, this 3D camera that I once bought. It had a 3D um, uh, screen, you know, without glasses you could see 3D. That is what I'm seeing in here. I see deepness because I can look straight through. Through the, it's, this is this is a holographic uh, uh, exposure. This is a holographic uh, 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 what you see, but uh, it's not. This is mono holographic. This is not uh, 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 quadraphonic, because if you go here, you don't see anything. You see, there's nothing there. It's only here, but the way it is being. Uh, Pictured from here looks fantastic. If you have that all fixed, then the view is too. It really looks amazing. Let's go a little bit closer. By the glass, but the reflection will be here. So the viewer that sits here will this glass is you know forty five degrees, but the picture stands straight and it's it stands behind the glass. It's not that it's in front of the glass, that while behind the glass there's nothing. And from all sides you can, space in there. But you the can look at it. That eh? If you look at it straight through the glass, the picture is here. And it does not stand in a 45 degree angle, it stands straight. So when I discovered that, I made a little 3D pyramid after seeing a video. And I was amazed about how it worked and in fact when I just made it and start playing with it and start a video of the same object but then that, that looks great huh? just imagine if you do this on a big screen of one meters you know and the only thing you need to do this is a piece of glass this glass does not cover the whole screen this is a 2d video and in my next video I'm gonna teach you how to make holographic videos from yourself how you yourself can do it but I'm gonna teach you how to make mono holographic videos so that will be easier you won't need uh, four cams and 360 and all these things you don't need that this is just for the viewer that wants to sit in his chair and have this holographic experience just think of it you know if you talk to your girl you know somewhere and she's uh, you know also doing these things that you can uh, uh, see her the way you see uh, me here in the screen that, that is what I'm gonna teach you in my next video in my next video we're gonna talk about how to you know make a video of yourself uh, that when you play it into the holographic mono uh, glass projector um, that it will show this way you know because you can see um, you can look straight to it there is no you know it's like 
the picture is cut out of the whatever the background was you know that while if you watch the real video you will see that there is background so why is this so you know so beautiful so cut out and so so perfect you know how can it be and that is what we're going to talk in my next video uh, about and uh, first of course i want you to share this video and i think it would be cool if uh, more people <laughs> i'm already small now i think it would be cool if more people uh, would kind of create things like this uh, also uh, i must warn you the glass that i used uh, was from some portrait uh, uh, picture holder you know those wooden things with glass on it with the four, four clips I just removed the picture out of it and used the glass, cleaned the glass real nice and put it there. But it's not even a 15 inch glass because it does not fit completely. You see, so that is kind of, it could be even better, it could be even bigger. So uh, I think if you do this on a 20 inch screen or, you know, uh, any screen that gives good light, it must give enough light. As you can see this Dell uh, Inspiron 6000, this old machine. Um, that was once bought for 10, year, uh, 10 euros uh, a while ago. We fixed it up, gifted a hard disk bay, gifted an adapter, you know, gifted a paint job, and it became one of the most popular yeah, laptops <laughs> here of my studio. And uh, also because I was showing on luck uh, of the bias of this laptop and <laughs> the video that got like 120k views still uh, being watched every day still getting requests like every day to help people out thanks to this laptop this Inspiron is a very very special laptop um, the things that uh, I presented uh, uh, with it until now and I think this is the second fantastic uh, presentation that I use this laptop for this laptop was just a laptop that I thought was good to you know to do crazy things with and you can see it now became a holographic mono projector uh, including of course the screen the glass screen and it works fantastic and you can make it it will cost you uh, under five bucks only thing you need is a piece of glass and glue it. Oh yeah, you did not see how I made it. So let's take a quick look at that. I'm gonna bring it just like that. Oh, I should not have done that. Oh, wait, hold on. I will just put it like this. So you can get a look. Well, to get, in fact, the glass on place, just find a good spot where to put it where you can maybe I had to put it even more to the but I didn't want to mess up the LCD so I just put it here at the end of the blue maybe I could put it a little bit more to the front maybe I could make it even more perfect to fit it you know maybe I could make a, 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 a door holder you know how you call this scharnier uh, you know fit it even better maybe I could use not glass but plastic that even uh, reflects better you know so I'm now investigating which uh, material I should use for so this. you know uh, when I discovered which one of the materials is the best to use and I hope it's a kind of plastic you know that is not so heavy and that will not cut you if you touch it and will be you know not so breakable so I must do some investigation in that if I found that then I will probably take my biggest TV and put it uh, flat, you know, and then put up a screen like this on it and have uh, a fantastic video uh, uh, player in my house for when I want to, you know, watch 3D videos without wearing glasses because it really gives the 3D experience peeps. This is no joke um, You must really try it out and I'm not gonna promote something that I Really love already and I'm really happy that I did the pyramid Project because thanks to the pyramid project, you know, I discovered mono holography 
and uh, I like it. I like it. Maybe I should call it one face holography. You know, it's fantastic. I can see if I'm looking at the picture from here. You know, I can just see that it's it's just amazing. I have no 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 words for this simple little hack what it um, what kind of feeling it gives you know things like this you don't see at normal people's house if you go to people's house you never see something like this a screen like this you know only if you come to millionaires houses you know so and now everybody thanks to this simple trick you know anybody everybody can now make their own holographic screen to watch videos on and remember the darker the video at the back the better the view will be so i already explained a little bit uh, how that works so but make sure to check my next video because this will get a little tail uh, this story we're gonna continue with with this because it's really cool um, we're gonna make a big one and we're gonna find a good material so if you're also gonna do this be careful if you do it with glass you know don't cut your fingers if you're young let somebody older help you to do this because I'm sure you young youth will love this older people will be like oh that's just reflection you know but it's really really amazing and you must take a look at it and uh, tell me what you think if you think this was a cool project of course like subscribe but more important share you know share the video don't download it and upload it again I mean like share this link of the video share it Facebook etc and show people how they can also get a fantastic device to uh, yeah to do more real life chatting peeps thanks again for watching see you in my next video bye